of his life and what a time to produce it well there's the lineup for the final of the women's hurdles Zagre of Belgium in lane two Bilo of France in three Porter Great Britain four Tale Belarus five Radcliffe Switzerland six Roland of Germany seven Peridou of Greece in eight and Dukovic of Germany in lane nine well, Tele, one of the threats, the 2012 European champion, World Championship bronze medals indoors a couple of times. But, uh, of course, Tiff Porter is the defending European champion, running in the fourth lane there. There she is, British record holder at 12.51, set in 2014 next to Tele. Remember Rolander over on the seventh lane? Well, we'll go and greet them one at a time. The Belgian record holder being introduced, first of all. Third in her semi-final, 12.89. Bilo of France, the European silver medalist four years ago, didn't go too well in her semi. Uh, Tiff Porter won her semi, a defending European champion, of course, British record holder. Numerous podium places for her, particularly indoors, at one outdoors. Alina Tale of Belarus, the 2012 European champion, world championship bronze medals indoors as well, won her semi-final. And then Radrus of Switzerland, twice the Swiss indoor champion, won her semi-final, 12.90. So, Rolander, the world silver medalist, she got the silver medal uh, despite being ranked 21st in the world at that time. Pesiridou of Greece, twice the Greek champion, didn't get beyond the heats four years ago, has done much better this time. And out uh, Kevich of Germany in this final. Right on the outside, second in the German indoor championship. She's got a best of 12.85 set this season. Ten barriers ahead of them and Tiff Porter. Not firing on six cylinders this season yet. Will this be the time it all happens for her? She defends her European championship title. Zagre, Billo, Porter, Tale, Radrus, Rolida, Pesiridou, Dukevich. The women's 100 meter hurdles final. this tally coming away with this and look at the challenge coming from rolander in the final stages and rolander gets the title wow tally gets second and tiff porter third and what about that for a close down in the last 10 15 20 meters the world championship silver medal proved why she did that last year a sensational finish absolutely sensational cindy rolander a european lead 12.62 Tale got the silver. It was between those two. Tale must have thought she'd got that. And Tiff Porter gets the bronze. From champion to bronze in four years, she's got another podium finish. A lot of credit to her. She's not been going at 100% this year. But I have to say that Cindy Rolander of Germany was just strong, very, very strong in the second part of that race. The last 30, 40 metres was terrific. Tiff Porter, well, knowing t she, she will be disappointed. Look at this. All of a sudden, uh, Alina Tale, the European champion eight years ago, thought she had it lunged for the line and Rolander took her. 
the top three way ahead of the rest but a very very good win by Cindy Rolida wow she was nowhere in it until beyond halfway and that's exactly what she did in qualifying for the final well time and again all year round we've seen Alina Telle burst out of the block she's particularly effective indoors so perhaps in many respects it came as no great shock that she led at halfway but it was if Cindy Rolida was winding it up winding it up winding it up and then over the last four barriers she just flew and she would have sensed that the balance of power over the last four hurdles was going her way. Rolanda then, the champion, European leading time, 12.62. Tale second, 12.68. She gets the silver. Tiff Porter gets the bronze.